Modern aircraft rely on interconnected digital systems for navigation, communication, and control. From autopilot to in-flight entertainment, these technologies make air travel safer and more efficient. However, this digital dependency creates potential entry points for cyber attacks. A single vulnerability in the aircraft's network could compromise multiple critical systems. The FAA reports that 85% of new generation aircraft use vulnerable IP-based networks. Researchers have identified three primary attack surfaces. The aircraft's onboard Wi-Fi, maintenance diagnostic ports, and even the ADSB tracking system. In 2019, cybersecurity experts demonstrated how a hacker could access flight control systems through the in-flight entertainment network. The aircraft's outdated software architecture, sometimes using code from the 1970s, makes these systems particularly vulnerable to modern hacking techniques. In a controlled 2018 experiment, DHS officials successfully hacked into a Boeing 757 parked at Atlantic City Airport. Using only a laptop, they breached the plane's systems through radio frequency communications. More alarmingly, a 2020 Euro control study revealed that one in five commercial aircraft have outdated cybersecurity protections. These aren't theoretical risks, they're happening today. A successful cyber attack could trigger catastrophic chain reactions. Hackers might alter navigation data, disable safety systems, or even take partial control of flight surfaces. The 2016 Polish Airlines incident, where hackers disrupted ground systems causing flight delays, showed how aviation infrastructure remains vulnerable. With planes carrying hundreds of passengers, the human cost of such breaches could be unimaginable. Aviation cybersecurity is improving with new measures. The 2021 ICAO standards mandate encrypted data links and multi-factor authentication for all aircraft systems. Airlines are implementing cyber black boxes to detect intrusions, while Boeing's new 787 Dreamliner features a physically isolated backup control system. Continuous security training for pilots and engineers completes this multi-layered defense approach to keep our skies safe.